and we are finally leaving downtown now, uh, leaving Callao, sorry. Doesn't look like we are getting in downtown, but remember that the downtown of Lima was walled, was protected by a lot of ramparts. We're gonna visit one of those parks, the Rampart Park, Parque de la Muralla. And this is how most of the middle class districts, the middle class area in Lima looks, no? In the past we had a few problems with the uh, delinquents, you can see how these neighborhoods yeah. or urbanizations, we call them, it's very funny, <laughs> it's how Lima was urbanized, we call them urbanizations, and they protect four or five blocks of these gates, that you see, no? all the gates and neighborhoods. On the other hand, we have this big complex for middle class, but built during the 1950s and 60s. Fortunately, we had a, a mayor, oh, sorry, a president that was an architect. And he realized that a lot of people were migrating from these towns, and were coming to Lima, but the local people in Lima were suffering these kind of problems. <laughs> you no? Know? Problems of traditions and customs, and they start to build. And unfortunately, in Lima, we don't have, in Peru, we don't have a health, a health system, a healthcare system. Look at your rights. The hospitals of solidarity. This is the only thing that we have for the middle and low class people that don't have resources to go to a hospital or pay in the other hand, no, a, a healthcare system and that's why they go there. The medicines are very cheap, but the service is not as good as in the other one, right? Yes. 